Hi everybody, Janice Brown here. How are you doing? Well, I had done a recording about five minutes ago. I did three beautiful pieces, which I will show you after. And I just want you to see the process. Fiona Art does it, and I fell in love with it, and it's just so beautiful. So let's see what I can make today. I'm gonna be doing Artist Loft and flow trawl for the base. I'll put that on there right there and spread it around my trusty little tongue depressor. I'm too glad you don't have to go see a doctor for a tongue depressor. Did you ever have a camera go down your throat? I did, it's like, whoa, it's really strange, you know? Okay, now. Just gotta smooth it around like this so it covers it evenly. And put that aside over here and I'll move that over there because that's gonna hold it once I get down to it. You know what I ought to do? Um, I'm gonna do all of them at the same time. So I've got three I'm gonna do for you today. And you wonder, what the heck am I doing with CDs? What am I gonna do? Well, I'm gonna do really cool art. Be using my mallet. I have a little mallet. I'm gonna put different colors, you know. So let me get this around here. I don't want it anywhere near here yet because when it goes splatter, and I got some bubbles here, so I'll have to get rid of some of them. Then again, it doesn't matter. All right, let me move this over on top of this little. Here's my full jewel up better. All right. Then I'm gonna move this one over this one. And that cup over there. Can't see it, but that's okay. You know I'm putting it on a cup. All right, and then last one right here. Each one has the, um, the glue, hot glue. So you just cover it up. It's very soupy because you need it soupy because you've got to be able to have it flow. This is why it's called fluid acrylic. It's not called just pouring. It's a chemical reaction. This is not for kids, this CD. I mean, this video. This is for adults only. And the reason being is I'm using chemicals. I'm not using just plain old straight paint. I'm using Floetrol, which you have to buy someplace else. And I'm using uh, fluid acrylic basics paint, which costs a little pretty penny. And I'm gonna move this over here. Okay, you can see very well. First thing I'm gonna do is do a dark blue spot right here, and one here, and here, and here. And then I'm gonna put this color blue next, cerulean blue. Didn't have to put that much on. It's very little, very little paint used in this process. I'm gonna do a little yellow here, if I have enough. I I use a bunch of the paint before while doing this, and I'm like, well, damn, it just kind of ticked me off. It didn't record. So make sure you're still recording. Yes, thank God. I usually check that, and then I just failed and didn't bother. I don't know. Sometimes I get so excited doing it and just seeing the, what transpires and what colors happen. I'm gonna do a little pink in this one. I have very little pink left, but I'm gonna try and squeeze some out of here. I would make more, but I hate pink. I'll just do that, those two. And then, oops, there were my CD over here. Let me get it up. I probably should have it. I should do it right on top of my board. My, um, Oh, this is nice, Quidacridum. 
stick that on there. All right, now you simply take a mallet and yes, squish them. But there's a technique. Trust me when I tell you. You just pound away. You have to know where to stop. That's all I can tell you. Okay, I've got a bubble right there. I'll smush. Alrighty, now I'm going to use a little yellow for little centers because I do see I have a center over here. There we go. Put one right there, and here, and here, and here, and here. Okay. And then I do want to get rid of this little guy here. Now, move this out of the way. I will show you a close up. Let me grab it. If I can grab it up under here. There we go. Oops. That's what one looks like. Isn't that pretty? Comes out gorgeous. These are ornaments. You put a hole on, drill a hole on top, and off you go. You hang it up. You see what are the bubbles? Good thing my dinner's cooked. It's leftovers from yesterday. All right, and then I'm gonna put this one over here while it sits. And I'm nabbing this one over here. Lock it. This time I'm gonna do yellow, yellow flower. One right in the center. And purple. I've got a little bit of purple left. Come on, you can drip. You don't use a lot of paint, so you, if you have, I'm gonna put one over here. Okay. I'm gonna use a little bit of the red on top of this one. And on top of this one. And a little bit here, and a little bit here, and then white. And then a little bit of blue here. Phthalo blue. This is permanent light blue. All right, let's see what we get now. Move this over. And you get to smash it. Let me get that way a little bit. Mmm, pretty. Pop a bubble here and there. And here and here. And here. Okay. 
Okay, let's see what that looks like. It's pretty too. Let me get rid of this bubble. Bubble trouble. Trouble bubble. No oh, new makeup on today. I didn't feel like it. I woke up tired. I've been tired all day. And I don't know why. Alrighty, I don't know if I need to put a little yellow. Nah, I'm gonna leave it as is. Okay. And now number three. Like plopping it down, you know? All right. Uh, I'll start with cerulean blue. And it's just going to be a simple one. Make it look like a, um, a bouquet of flowers, I'm thinking. Alrighty, let's see. And put some yellow there, make so I get some green leaves. Yellow and blue make green, in case you didn't know. Red and blue will make violet, so I'm going to stick some together here with the red. Put one there. Here we go. Put one here. And then I'll do a little bit of white. Here. Phthalo blue on the other, on the top. Okay. All right, here we go. My sister was wondering, how do I do this? Well, that's how. <laughs> this is bigger flowers because I'm really getting and really doing it big. All right, now. Look at the cells happening right here. I don't know why. Cells over here too. Cool. Cool. All It's pretty. Wow. It really is pretty. Let me see what. Uh, cool. Look for the big bubbles. Oh, I got a, a white spot there I don't like. Look at that. Do a little different here. I'm gonna go a little of a center part without putting yellow. This one's really pretty. I love it. I love the red. I probably should do some red over there, so hold on. Okay.
it just needed it right there. That's all I know. It just needed it. Alrighty, let's see. As I get the, as I just wiped it here. Okay. I don't see any more bubbles. This is pretty too, a little darker. Alrighty. Well, this is a quickie. Wraps it up really quick when you do it like this. Okay, I'm gonna take it down and show you this. And I'll show you what I did earlier where it did not record. So, I have to turn you off for a second, then I'll turn you back on. Where's my thing? 